with the Hollywood Film Awards about to interview Charlize Theron, the girl Hi. Nicole Kidman, Renee Zellweger, Jennifer Garner, and Charlize Theron, A-list stars, brought their fashion A-game at the Hollywood Film Awards. Congratulations Thank on the so Career much. Achievement Award. I feel like my job is such a gift, and it really truly is the award. So this is like the cherry on this amazing cake that I get to live every single day. Bombshell is the latest film in her career. Out December 13th, Charlize, who received her award from co-star Nicole Kidman, plays Megyn Kelly in the tale of sexual harassment at Fox News. Did you talk to her beforehand or during the process? No, I mean, there was a lot of conversations going back with a lot of women who work there, and uh, we've, we've decided to be really respectful and protect our sources. A lot of women really risked a lot to, to talk to us and tell their, share their stories. Welcome Hollywood breakthrough screenwriter Shia LaBeouf. Shia's first screenplay, Honey Boy, getting rave reviews. Robert Downey Jr. presented to a very candid, very thankful Shia. I want to thank the police officer who arrested me in Georgia for changing my life. Um, I want to thank my therapist and my sponsor for saving my life. I want to thank my Honey Boy team for documenting and exhibiting my life. Um, I want to thank my team for being a part of my life. And my parents for giving me life. Thank you for, uh, for inviting me. I appreciate it. Have a good night. This night, a preview of awards season, and the stars were out. Ford versus Ferrari stars Matt Damon and Christian Bale on stage. And backstage, a collision of legends, Al Pacino, Francis Ford Coppola and Martin Scorsese. Viola Davis handed the Breakout Actress Award to Cynthia Erivo, who was honored to share the story of famed freedom fighter Harriet Tubman in Harriet. She's like the original badass, and she is a woman that has changed the face of the world, and I'm really glad to be a part of that, that moment. It's important. Nothing more important to Antonio Banderas than his girlfriend Nicole and his daughter Stella, especially after a life-changing event. You just recently uh, I think it was in 2017, suffered a heart attack, and it, it changed some things for you. Things that were very important before yeah. that it st stopped being important. And, uh, and the real things, my daughter, my family, my friends, and my vocation as an actor is what really, really stayed. Rocketman star Taron Edgerton brought his girlfriend, Emily Thomas, to celebrate his big breakout actor award for playing Elton John in the film. When I was 17, I auditioned for drama school with the song, Your Song. And I never dreamed that 13 years later, I'd have the chance to sing it on screen as Elton John. Never mind sing it with him for thousands of people, and more importantly, become his friend. Breakthrough actor at 30 years old? Yeah, yeah imminently. A, exactly a week from now, I'm 30. So how will Taryn celebrate his new decade? I'm going to fly home to the UK with my lovely girlfriend and I'm going to find my mother and my best friends and we are going to drink wine and eat lots of bread. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.